Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. IRS announces job openings to hire over 700 new employees across the country to help taxpayers in person. Uh, in person? Oh, great. This must be like the IRS's new collection squad. Knock, knock. It's the IRS. We're here to help you, taxpayer. Pay your taxes. And it's like, well, I see. But why do you look like the SWAT team? Shut up, taxpayer. You're lucky we even knocked. After tracking your online activity for months and seeing you even gave money to those nasty Canadian truckers, IRS collection agent Dirty Harry over here, who has a side gig as like a, a TikTok drag queen, he wanted to start this raid off with tear gas right through the window. Rest assured, IRS agent Dirty Harry's next drag queen story hour will be about you, the sad taxpayer that we collected from. Hey, wait a second. Don't take my rug. Dang it. That rug really tied the room together. This was a valued rug. <clears throat> this was a... Uh... Yeah, man, it really tied the room together. So this was a value, dog. Yeah. Tied the room together, dude? My rug. Were you listening to the dude's story, Donnie? What? When the press demanded that the president come clean, President Biden screamed, I'll tell you just like I told my nanny. I refuse to take a bath. She's my flower. Did, did, did you guys see something? Chicken. And then he insisted inflation is not a thing. Wow. This is great. And even if it was a thing, it's a good clean thing. Hey, Chavis, how come they ain't killing us? In the spirit world, asshole, they can't see us. <laughs> and even, even if it's not a good, clean thing, it's transitory. Hey, you know we're in the spirit world? <laughs> and, and even if it's not transitory, it's only impacting rich, like, financial stock traders. <laughs> oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> and even if it totally doesn't impact just rich, like, stock trader people, normal people deserve it. Because they're all bigots. When's a donkey spelled with one letter? When it's you! Well, and even if normal people don't deserve it. I dreamed about flying on a unicorn last night. And the unicorn I was flying on totally excremented rainbow money over the entire country I will flew over. And everyone was so happy. That's preposterous. You're on. I want to go back to dreamy time now. Don't be a fool, you idiot. I'll be whatever I want to do. That guy was the greatest businessman that ever lived. And before his mysterious death, he taught me everything he knew. But some things I had to learn myself. I learned that money is fine, but in the end, what counts is people. People you love. You can't put a price on that. And so I'm giving up control of the company to a man of enormous experience, Professor Hubert Farnsworth. Oh, what? I'm awake, I'm awake. IR 2022-197, November 9, 2022, Washington. In addition to the more than 4,000 people recently hired to fill critical customer service representative positions, the Internal Revenue Service is now seeking over 700 new employees to help taxpayers at taxpayer assistance centers across the country. Quote, this is an important priority to provide more service at the IRS for the upcoming filing season, end quote, said Ken Corbin the services taxpayer experience officer and wage and investment commissioner so quite the long title there for mr corbin quote we are working to have more than 270 walk-in sites properly staffed to provide the help taxpayers need and deserve this will be the first time in a decade our walk-in sites will be fully staffed end quote 
This increase in staffing is part of much wider IRS improvements enabled by the Inflation Reduction Act. So you're spending a bunch of money here. I'm not saying possibly that it's not well needed money to be spent, but you're spending a bunch of money that's going to decrease decrease inflation, which I would only assume it's going to decrease inflation because you named the bill Inflation Reduction Act. So how does this tie to does this tie to reducing inflation in any it's almost like they misnamed the bill so they could spend a bunch of money on stuff and lie about it. OK, OK, just move on. Just move on. It's it's ridiculous. I OK, it's OK. Anyways, the funding approved in August 2022 and additional updates on the implementation of the landmark 10 year legislation will be provided soon. IRS employees not only serve the agency, but are imperative to the nation's tax administration, which collected nearly 96% of the nation's revenue needed uh, to fund nearly all federal government programs. I mean, honestly, just to go back to this a second, I've been reading about the Inflation Reduction Act and these news things. Like, I swear, like 75% of the news things have been related to this Inflation Reduction Act. And none of the, those news articles have implemented or implied in any way that inflation is going to be reduced by any of the spending. Like it's more spending, which you would think would increase. It doesn't like you would think, OK, my mind is just go back to the read. Just read it. Just read the thing. So the work we do supports the nation's most vital initiatives from Homeland Security and U.S. Defense to Social Security, as well as programs and projects, including parklands and forests, roads and bridges, libraries, museums, schools and more. All that stuff. You would think you can sell that stuff to people on its own merits without lying. But that's just that's just how I would do. That's just how I think the thing should happen. But whatever. Uh, for these 700 openings, the technical positions needed are individual taxpayer advisory specialists who provide face-to-face -face assistance in IRS TAC offices and the initial assistance representatives responsible for greeting and determining the needs of taxpayers visiting TAC offices. These important positions have highly competitive pay and benefits, including the, the job training opportunities for advancement, health and life insurance, and federal retirement. Well, the IRS also offers a wealth of workplace flexibilities to help employees balance career and home with 11 paid holidays, 13 vacation days, and sick leave. So it sounds like a pretty sweet government deal, possibly funded by the, the bill that's going to reduce inflation, which isn't going to do that, but... They lied about it, so whatever. So other work-life balance programs include flexible work schedules, the child care subsidy program, the employee assistance program, health services and paid maternity uh, paternity leave. And uh, in addition to the face-to-face -face representatives and phone assisters, the IRS is also working to hire additional people throughout the agency, not just in taxpayer service areas, but in information technology and compliance positions, all with a goal of improving the IRS, uh, IRS does. The IRS is an equal opportunity employer and hires talented and dedicated individuals from many backgrounds. IRS encourages those who are looking for a new opportunity or who are just starting work life to consider an IRS career. All employees must be U.S. citizens and pass an FBI fingerprint check and tax compliance verification. Federal experience is not required. The applicant may have gained experience in the public sector, private sector, or volunteer service. Prospective employees are encouraged to attend an upcoming IRS career information session to, uh, to learn more about the position and requirements, how to apply, and all the benefits of federal service. So obviously it could be a good, be a good move for some people. Uh, I would think it would have, you know, good benefits and, and a good uh, training program and whatnot. <clears throat> so even though it's funded with with lies, but still might be a good thing to check out. So in any case, you got the register here. There's a link to it. 
for the hiring information session on November 17th at 1 p.m. Eastern time. To learn more about this position, you can visit USA Jobs. There's a link to that here. To learn about other open positions at the IRS, go to the IRS Careers page. Also follow the IRS on LinkedIn and on Twitter. So they're on LinkedIn and Twitter and whatnot. I don't follow them on all that stuff. So if anybody's getting uh, vital information that I'm missing out on on the tweets from the IRS, you know, let me know. Maybe I need to maybe I need to update my my dated practice and skills here. In any case, more information at the links below IRS job events, find an IRS job, IRS local offices. There's links to that and links to all the other stuff we said there was a link to check it out. There'll be a link to this in the description.